paste the new URL, then click on import. And you can see right here, they, it imported the same six articles, but they will have the featured image. Let's publish them. There you go. We have successfully published all these six articles. Now let's take a look at if, if the featured image have been added. So let's take a look at how steep is the cheese rolling hill. So let's click that article. And just like that, we have the featured image included in our um, pike here. If you see it's quite blurred, it's because here, the setting in the RSS image size that I selected, it's just a thumbnail. You should be selecting full size, okay? You will be able to have full size image of the featured, okay? Do that, uh, select this full size and then click on save. And then I just copy this. You can download the new RSS feed file and then import them again. So the website is hashnode.dev. So as you can see here, you can create multiple blogs. And this is a powerful because if you check this in uh, ahref it has got a domain rating of 81 and for example you write we want to add review articles on this platform so if you take a look at the semrush data if you go to the domain data and you type you filter with the word review as you can see it's got a number of traffic and uh, 6,000 keywords rank ranking with the term review you scroll down right here there are you know keywords many keywords that you can rank on this platform right here especially when you have multiple articles publishing this platform, uh, you will have better chances of a good amount of traffic publishing articles to this platform right here. So to easily do that, this tactic that I'm going to show you is follow exactly how doing it so that you will be able to easily create your articles. So first of all, we will create a temporary WordPress because this is how we are going to do. We will be publishing all our articles to this temporary WordPress and migrate it to Hashnode. Okay. This is how you will do it. So create this temporary WordPress. So I'm going to do that now. So once your temporary WordPress has been created, add these credentials to Article AI Generator. So I'm going to sign into my account. Here, I'm going to click this Add Sites. I will be adding these credentials to Article AI Generator so I can easily generate bulk articles and migrate those articles to Hashnode. Let's do that now. So here, we're copying the URL from the temporary WordPress. Remove this WP admin. Make sure it's just the uh, HTML itself without any parameter right here. And then add your username and password. Okay, now this site is added. Let's go ahead and grab some keywords. So here, we will be doing cheese rolling as our, you know, uh, niche. So as you can see right here, this has significant amount of topics that we can create using cheese rolling as our, you know, niche. Look at this. We have low competition of keywords, so we can easily get rankings, especially when we are publishing these articles in a higher domain rating. So just take a look on how the steps will be done. I'm going to choose several articles to be published in our temporary WordPress. Let's do that now. So once you have selected your keywords or the title of the articles that you want to generate. So let's select them. Now here, I will be pasting that to generate bulk articles here. Let's do that. And here, I'm going to auto post that, click yes, select yes, and then select the newly added, you know, WordPress that you have here. But before that, make sure you install the required plugin right here. This one, just click this and follow the guide. So here in your WordPress dashboard, click on add new plugin here. Click this, upload plugin right here. Now install this plugin and then make sure you activate it. Once you're done, you will see this JSON basic authentication. So no other configuration is required. Just go to settings and then click on now select permalinks right here. Double check if post name is selected because it helps a lot in SEO. Now, once all the basic settings is done, we are good to go on generating this uh, in articles right here. And I'm gonna show you how you can easily migrate them to this platform right here, which is Hashnode, a powerful platform where you can publish bunch of articles and easily get some rankings, especially when you're publishing low competition keywords. So here I will be selecting featured image so that my articles will be more attractive. And I'm going to just choose short for now. Let's publish the articles. Now it's ready to generate this. And as you can see right here, all the six articles that we are generating have been completed. So they should be now in our WordPress. So you go to post section right here. You can see these are all the articles that we publish. So just let's check one of the articles right here, how the cheese rolling starts. So let's view this and look at this. We have a pretty interesting featured image right there. And here is our SEO friendly write number of words and optimized structured article, which is eligible to rock on Google. So let's check the number of words. You can see right here, even though we select short article, we were able to produce 1,700 words. And now this is how you're going to migrate to uh, Hashnode 
if you want to migrate all these articles that you generated in our temporary WordPress and transfer them to Hashnode. So here, the first thing that we must do is delete this sample article right here. And what we're going to do, so this is our URL, and then you add this one feed, okay, to that and type this in your browser, paste this, it will download the feed feed file from your WordPress. And here, go to this website, file.io. Make sure you upload that fe uh, downloaded feeds of your articles. So here, we uploaded the RSS file. Now, copy this URL right here. Now, we go to Hashnode. So the first time when you sign into your dashboard and you don't have any blog created, click this new blog and click this personal blog. So this one, we will name it as Cheese Rolling. So this is our niche and the URL of our blog will just be cheese rolling and then click on create. Now that it's created right here, you go to the dashboard, take the dashboard and here in the dashboard, you scroll down and click this import and here in RSS, we are now able to paste the RSS that we uploaded here just like that and click on import. And just like that, we easily imported all the articles we have from our temporary WordPress. So you just click on publish and that's it. You have now published the six articles right here. So let's just check one of the article. How steep is the cheese rolling hill? So let's do that. And look at that. We're able to migrate our articles from our temporary WordPress to Hashnode blog platform. And as you notice, the featured image hasn't been uh, included in the uh, migrate. So what you need to do in order for you to include the featured images, I forget this step, but it's very simple. So in your WordPress right here, go to plugins, click on add new plugin. And here in the search, just type in RSS image, okay, finish RSS. So just type that. And here you can select any of these RSS image plugin right here. But the recommended one that I'm uh, installing is this one right here featured images in RSS. Okay. If you see this, just install that and then click on activate. So here, just skip this and this one right here, just keep the default configuration and click on save changes. Now you need to paste this URL again so that we will be downloading the fresh RSS file with the featured image and we will need to migrate RSS file again. Okay. So happy this, paste it to your URL. Now that we downloaded the fresh copy of RSS with the featured image details. So Come over to file.io again and let's upload the new RSS. Come back to this hash node and we want to delete first those articles that we just migrated without the featured image. So we won't be duplicating the articles. Uh, there's no bulk action we can do, but since we just migrated six articles, so we can easily remove this. Okay, so I deleted all. So to avoid doing double work, make sure you install the RSS featured image plugin first before you download the feeds so that the RSS file that will be generated will have the featured image details. Okay, now let's do the import again. Take this import, select this RSS tab and paste the newer URL. And then click on import. And you can see right here, they, it imported the same six articles, but they will have the featured image. Let's publish them. There you go. We have successfully published all these six articles. Now let's take a look at if, if the featured image have been added. So let's take a look at how steep is the cheese rolling hill. So let's click that article. And just like that, we have the featured image included in our um, pack here. If you see it's quite blurred, it's because here, the setting in the RSS image size that I selected, it's just a thumbnail. You should be selecting full size, okay? You will be able to have full size image of the featured, okay? Do that, uh, select this full size and then click on save. And then I just copy this. You can download the new RSS feed file and then import them again. That's how easy you can in a bunch of articles from your in WordPress to publish in articles directly to hash node can start ranking. So you can do that for all these articles. So imagine if you're going to publish these 138 articles, you have a really good chance of getting quick rankings from Google, especially you are publishing that to a, you know, powerful a platform, which can easily rank articles. Uh, just like what I showed you earlier, it can rank multiple review uh, terms and other term that uh, you have here in hash node that dev. That's about it, guys. So if you have any questions, uh, just leave that in the comment below. And if you want more tutorial tutorials like this, don't forget to uh, subscribe and uh, please hit the like button. Thank you and see you in the next one.